I could stay like this Forever following you Just don't get too far And I'll be right where you are You're We all know Guan has already fallen for Dohae in My Demon, but people wonder if Song Kong also feels the same way about Kim Yujong, outside the filming set and he's spoken up about it very clearly. They say you can tell a person like someone by the way they look at them. Well if that's the case, Song Kong surely looks at Kim Yujong in a unique way. So we all know where this is headed. The drama has released a few behind-the-scenes clips and in almost every video Song Kong was caught staring at Yu Jong a couple of times, as early as during their photo shoot for their drama's poster. Song Kong has been stealing a few glimpses of Yu Jong. In this footage, it can be seen that they're still a bit awkward towards each other. He was about to put his arms around her, but she still felt a bit shy at the same time. You could also tell he was also nervous when he finally had his arms wrapped around her. Kim Yoo Jung's stylist had to fix her hair and if you were quick enough to notice while the stylist was doing her thing, Song Kong quickly checked on her before looking straight to the camera. During their photo shoot he only sneaked a quick glimpse at her, probably because they were in a small studio and everyone had their eyes on them, and was purely focused on them. But when filming began, he became a bit bolder and looked at her for a much longer period of time. Some of it was no longer a glimpse but was already a stare. Just like in this behind-the-scenes footage where Kim Yoo Jong had to do her drunk scene before filming, she was practicing how to do her scene since she had to act drunk and at the same time deliver it in a cute way. But while she was busy doing her thing, Song Kong was staring at her. It seemed like she really looked cute and was a Song Kong unapproved moment since he was staring at her in a lovey de bay way and even smiled and laughed once she was done. But he didn't end there. Right after that scene he was again caught staring at her. Song Kong was captivated by her charm since whatever Kim Yoo Jung does he finds it cute and always ends up staring at her. But he doesn't just stand there and stare at her from time to time. Song Kong also loves to show his care and affection by showing some act of service towards Kim Yoo Jung on the set. Both are always seen smiling and laughing together. In this behind-the-scenes footage, they were practicing their kiss scene and took it very seriously since they had to perfect their angle and had to match every movement they had to do. But even at that moment they were able to still sneak a few giggles with each other while laughing. He noticed she was leaning on a metal barrier, so without any hesitation he immediately placed his hand behind her head to prevent her from any potential risk. After placing his hand behind her head, Kim Yoo Jong comfortably moved her head and Song Kong seemed to be happy with what he did and simply smiled while looking at her. Aside from all those things we've noticed Song Kong has done, he actually has already revealed his ideal type. He prefers to look into someone's individual charm rather than how they look, but aside from that, he also likes it when someone exudes a warm aura. There are times when he gives off a serious and strong vibe, but in fact he's a softie as he revealed that he's the type of person who falls in love at first sight. He may easily fall in love at first sight, but the downside is that he is unable to make a confession since he's not really good at expressing his feelings. In fact, he had a bad experience in confessing his feelings way back when he was still in high school. He shared that during that time he had a crush on someone for almost three months, but nothing really happened and there was number progress at all since he was too shy to confess his feelings towards her. However, he was able to conquer his shyness when he finally confessed to another girl, but in order to do that, he had a little help with some alcohol to drown down his shyness right before he had the courage to make his confession. Because of his experiences, he would love to meet someone who's the opposite of him, someone who's good at expressing their feelings. Once he starts spending time with that someone and eventually gets close and sees their warmth and openness, this helps him open up more about his feelings. Then the moment he gets comfortable and finds out that person is warm, kind and good at communicating, he would love to take her out on a date to his favorite cafe. Song Kong also mentioned that looks don't really matter to him, but during a Q&A with Lulu Lala, he was able to reveal more details of what his ideal type is. He prefers a woman with long hair and when it comes to height, short or tall, it doesn't really matter to him. He was also asked whether he prefers a woman who resembles a cat or a dog, but he answered both. Lastly, when it comes to makeup, he prefers someone who wears light makeup after knowing his ideal type. We all know it perfectly describes Kim Yoo Jong, so no wonder he's always caught staring at her. 
she's known to be a very warm and kind person because of her personality. In fact, there was actually a moment when Song Kong praised Yu Jung Beauty. Even before their drama aired, netizens were already amazed at how their visuals perfectly matched. Both are definitely good looking and their beauty complemented each other and that's why people started calling them the visual couple. They then got the chance to address their reputation as a visual couple during an interview with El Korea. Without any hesitation, he answered she is doing the heavy lifting in that aspect. He gave all the credit to her beauty and at the same time he believes she's the reason why they got the title. We can tell Song Kong's ideal type perfectly matches Kim Yoo Jong, but both actually revealed an interesting similarity that they already shared, he revealed that they both very rational. He further explained by using their MBTI results, and it turns out that they're both claimed towards T which is thinking instead of F which dwells more on feelings. He's 92% T while only 8% in F. Song Kong explained, we're both rational people, and we lean toward the far T side on our MBTI personality test, I'm apparently 92% T and 8% F. Some strong F people, would think that we're soulless, but we don't see ourselves that way. Kim Yoo Jong and I have a good conversation every time. Kim Yoo Jong agreed and share her results as well. She commented, I got 95% T and 5% F on that test so when we talk together, we never misunderstand each other, or ask things like, why do you think like that? We all figured out what Song Kong, really thinks about Kim Yoo Jong, but what the other way around. In an interview, she spoke on that matter and said, Song Kong is someone filled, with so much passion, that was my initial impression of him. Now I just think he's perfect in every way. But upon hearing what she said, Song Kong smiled satisfactorily, then shared his thought, he said, for me Kim Yoo Jong was flawless from the beginning. In another interview, Kim Yoo Jong actually revealed, that she finds Song Kong very attractive. She also complimented, how great his passion for acting was whenever they were working on set, which make her feel really grateful that she had an opportunity to work with him. Meanwhile, there's also one thing that she finds attractive about him and it's his height, she envy his height so much, that if there was a ways, she steal it from him. We can't deny how crazy their chemistry is, how they are perfectly match each other, and right now they're already, even look like a perfect couple, but as of now neither the actors nor their management, hasn't made any comments regarding the status of their relationship. However, we might consider the fact, that Song Kong will be enlisting soon in the army. So it will be difficult for him to start dating at the moment, but again we don't really what may happen because we don't know, what the real status they have. There's even an advantage for both of them, if that happens since they get to spend more time together secretly. We can't deny, the possibility of them actually dating, as they're really doing the most with the fan service. This is just added to our list, of how perfect they'd be as a couple. What are your thoughts about it? Share your replies in the comments section down below. That's it for the video guys I hope you like it, stay tuned for more updates of your favorite Korean star. Visit Korean Thingy for more updates of your favorite Korean star, don't forget to subscribe, and thanks for watching.